Welcome back. Well, today we're going to be starting a new project. We are going to be filling up our terracotta pots that we have on our front porch. We're going to be dividing some of the garlic chives from our main garden and adding them to some new plants that we've picked up from our local garden center. And some of these plants include chrysanthemums. We've got some gyardia. We've got ice plants. I will be sure to put all of the plants that we are using today in the description below. So let's get started. Well, I ran into a snag. So, unfortunately, when I was trying to get my garlic chives out from my garden bed, I was unable to get any garlic chives without completely damaging the roots. And that was so much harder than I thought it was gonna be. So, I'm just gonna try to make do, I think, with the plants that I have. And I may end up back at the garden center to maybe get some garlic chives that are already growing um, instead because this just did not work for me. So in the future, I think I will just let those be. I am just shocked at how well rooted they were and there were bees flying all around me trying to get to the blossoms. <laughs> it was a disaster. So whew, yeah, again, kudos to you who that can divide your garlic chives with no issue at all because I thought that was the hardest thing ever. But with that being said, we'll get started on prepping our pots and getting everything ready to go to start planting. I am gonna be using some raised garden bed mix. I have my Biotone starter mix and some garden time mushroom compost. Now I want to take a moment to unbox this beautiful watering can that I got from Berry and Bird. Um, I've been excited to give it a try and it's going to be perfect for watering all of these beautiful pots that we just filled up. So the packaging was really nice and secure which is always a good sign and as I open it up I can already tell this is a high quality product. Oh. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. Well, that is just such a great take on like a 
a vintage but with a modern touch look i love it oh my goodness that is so cute so it looks like it comes with a little um plug thing for the end spout so when you're finished using it it's made out of steel so that's going to help to not rust so it'll look new for a really long time I like that. Oh my gosh, and the design of it is just absolutely perfect. Really appreciate the long spout too because it makes it easy to reach the deep into the pots and under the leaves without spilling water everywhere. And the handle design is actually really comfortable um, to carry and I can tell this is going to be a really good watering can. And I know they didn't know this, but my favorite color is green. So this has totally made my day. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love this product. Well, shout out to Barry and Bird. Thank you so much for sending this to me and letting me review it for you. I would highly recommend this for anybody who is interested in a very adorable watering can um, with a very thin nozzle that is easy to water pots, especially like this, or indoor plants especially, something where it's gonna help you have better control to water your plants. If I had to give it a con, which is very hard for me to do, I think I would love to see this in larger sizes as well. I love the handle design. I love the color. Um, they even have this cute little berry and bird emblem on the top. It is just absolutely adorable. I love it. All right, guys. Well, that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, don't forget to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe if you're new to our channel. And I hope to see you again on the next one. Bye.